Hello, my name is Phil Spencer and I'm here to talk to you about how to deliver a great defect-free surface when carrying out sunken trench reinstatement. The emphasis in today's world is on keeping road networks and footways open and back to how it should be because it's an impact on safety, productivity and efficiency and the general well-being of society. The L271 is a cold applied MMA based surface dressing repair system, giving an outstanding permanent and durable solution. It's widely used on highly traffic locations, particularly where sunken trenches have been given a road defect. It's a far superior alternative to cold or hot ash belts, accommodates shallow depths down to 0.5 mil. It's a very fast cure with excellent addition but it also offers flexibility with adjoining substrates. It's highly resistant to impact and maintains slip resistance for road safety. Now let's hand over to our expert demonstration team who will run through the steps involved with these applications in more detail. We are going to repair this sunken channel leading to a drain. The first step is to thoroughly sweep the application area clear of any loose material, dirt and dust. Then we will tape the edge of the application area which will give us a neat finished look after the application. To make sure of an aesthetically pleasing result, we are measuring the width of the taped area, making sure that the repair will be the same width along the length of the application. We are going to apply a deep film mix first with 2-6mm to aggregate in and then apply the resin only over the entire surface. As the depth of this application varies slightly, what we are doing here is holding a straight edge across the width of the application and marking where it is deep enough to apply the deep fill mix. This way we can make sure we are maximising the use of the bulking out of the product with aggregate. Now we move on to the mixing. This is a simple three stage process, freshening up the resin, adding aggregate and adding peroxide. The Permafix L271 resin contains a 2.5mm charge which settles in transit so what we need to do first is freshen up the product making sure all that charge is evenly distributed in the mix. It is important that we use the right equipment when mixing this product. This should be an 18 volt mixing drill with a 120 mm diameter whisk. Ideally, we would use an electric 110 volt twin handled mixer. Once mixed, scrape around the edges and base of the tin with a mixing stick to check there is no settled material left. Now we are ready to add the aggregate. We recommend pouring the resin into a flexible mixing tub which has a slightly larger capacity than the tin. Steadily pour in the aggregate whilst mixing. We advise adding the aggregate at a ratio of 1 to 1 by weight. Any extra aggregate to this will start to compromise the bond strength of the product. Continue mixing until there is no sign of any dry or exposed aggregate. Next we add the peroxide catalyst. We recommend pouring the three 80 gram sachets into a small jug first so that we can evenly disperse it into the mix whilst mixing. Once this is added, it is important to make sure we continue mixing for a minimum of two minutes so that the entire mix will cure. The equipment should be cleaned immediately as this product will cure quickly. The Permafix L271 is now poured into the areas we have marked for deep fill and spread evenly using a metal spazzle. This then needs to be trailed over to compress it sufficiently and produce a strong bond. For the surface layer, we are going to apply the product without any extra aggregate. So we repeat the same mixing process of freshening up the resin, then adding the peroxide and mixing for 2 minutes. We pour this mix over the entire area, including deep fill patches, and trail it out to the right to the taped edges to give us our final surface. The tape can be removed after 10 minutes. There we have our repair channel, which we have prevented from sinking further and becoming a large problem in the future. 
Current repair systems would involve large equipment, which in turn is a large investment and involves a lot of transportation. Hot works, which have health and safety risks, excavation works and cuts, and it would last for a minimum of three years. The new Permafix L271 involves no large equipment and no hot works, no excavation works or cuts, and the results are expected to last a minimum of five years. The L271 is an ideal solution for not only sunken trench work, but preventative maintenance where there is crazed or scarred surfaces. Using these approved, tried and tested methods, Mion can guarantee you peace of mind, cost savings and defect-free reinstatement. On our website www.meonuk.com, the data sheets can be found and also a huge wealth of knowledge and resource in the form of case studies, how-to guides, and frequently asked questions. If you would like further information, a sample, or a demonstration, then please do get in contact. We're personally available to support you with your project. Call 02392 200 606 or email mail at meonuk.com. Thank you for watching.